Hello, I'm here with GNR uh, Entertainment Reviews, and this is the new purple iPod 16 gigabytes. Um, so, what we have here is the new iPod, and as you can see, no same old, same things as the other ones. Um, when you get to the front format, you have shuffle songs at the bottom, but get to music. So music, I go to songs, all the songs. I am gonna go, and I'll pick Diamonds Are Forever. So I'm playing this song. Now I can see the ca album art, you know, it's by Kanye West, featuring such and such. And then if I turn it to the side. It goes into a thing called Cover Flow, which then lets me browse all of the songs. And you've probably seen this on iTunes, but all of the songs by their covers. Um, and if I don't pick any I want, I just flip it back up and keep playing. Now, if I do want to switch the songs I'm playing um, in Cover Flow, I hold this to the side and there. Um, and then I just click it. Shows me a song. Now I'm listening to that. Flip it back up. Now there. Okay. Now if I don't want to just use this button to switch to the next song or whatever, um, I can just simply shake it, and it'll shuffle and pick a random, completely random song. Any song. So, that's kind of nice, because then you just don't have to go into the shuffle mode if you want to say you're listening to a classical music and you just want something random, shake it, and you get a completely different song. Okay. So there's that. Then there's also, I'm listening to Um, I'm listening to Four Minutes by Madonna. Then I can hold the center button, and this thing pops up, which says, Start Genius, Add to Onto the Go Playlist, Browse Album, Browse Artist. Now, if I click Start Genius, then it creates a playlist for me with all of the songs in my library alike to that one. And then if I actually want to listen to those, I can save playlist or I can refresh and then I'll get completely new ones. Okay, so then that's called the genius. Now I can also go to my videos where I can watch movies and the uh, screen is surprisingly big enough. Um, I actually wasn't sure when I bought it if it was going to be um, a large enough screen, but in fact it is, and it's very easy to enjoy um, a movie by watching um, and I have five videos, and I've only used around, you know, nine gigabytes. So, um, oh, great, great quality. Um, and it has this wonderful widescreen, um, widescreen form that makes it, because of the old Nano, uh, the top and bottom was cut off to make it into widescreen, but this, it is the widescreen already. Okay, then you can go to rentals. I haven't rented any movies. You can go to TV shows, Family Guy. Uh, that's the same idea, you know, blah, blah. Um, you can watch it just like that. Um, music videos, and then you can do settings. 
fit the screen, all that stuff. Um, now there's also a place for photos. I don't have any photos. Um, games, and surprisingly, uh, you can download the games off iTunes. I actually didn't know that. Um, and you can get a lot of cool games, like, um, get, uh, and the cool thing that about this that I wasn't aware of when I bought it was the um, was the uh, um, you know and then you can just mess around with Tetris or whatever um, also having the capability of playing games you also have the thing um the accelerometer, which is one of the things that makes the iPod Touch so great, it's the how you know you can tip and play. Um, and for example, Maze. This game you can also play the um, number of racing games, but um, this game this is on a higher level, so we'll go back. Um, um, uh, I don't know if you can, yeah, you probably can't see that, but, um, the, oh, here we go, there. You see the ball in the lower left hand corner. And I'm just tilting the iPod, um, but because of the accelerometer, it, whoops, it, um, the ball moves with it. Um, and then you can play a bunch of different cool games. Um, shuffle songs, just like always. And then in the shuffle song, you can also shake it. Um, and at the bottom of your screen right there, it also shows you whatever you've just chosen. So if I'm music, I'll have pictures of music, videos, I'll have my movies, and so on and so forth. So, all in all, this is an incredible... It's a steal for your $200. For $200... You can have 16 gigabytes of incredibly clear glass top touched finished case with like amazing curved sides and 2.5 or 3 inch 2.5 inch screen that's just is remarkably wonderful and so this is a definite yes Jnr reviews this is Guardian